Team Tech MMA. Go. We're at the Team Tech Gym here in Adrian, Michigan. I'm Tom Bidell. Tom, welcome. And we're, today we're going to show you how to do a Kimura. Alright. First Kimura we're going to go over is the one from side control. When you get your opponent grounded and you get up on him like this, you attack his hand, his arm, two on one, on the opposite side than your knees are. you got to get a hold of his wrist and get your arm underneath him, underneath his arm. Bend his elbow. The more bent you can get his elbow, the better. Bring one foot up, the foot closest to his head, over his head. Bring his arm down behind his back and pry it back. The closer you can get his elbow to his belly button before you do this motion. Bring his arm this way. The more torque it creates up on the rotator cuff. You give it the pull, and there comes the tap. The next part of the Kimura is from if he's in my guard. I'm guard. Your opponent takes you to the ground or sweeps you or something and he winds up in your guard. So first thing is to close your guard and control his posture. Get him down. I like to with an overhook and get like a tie plum on the back of his head from the ground. You wanna when you decide you're gonna do it, you wanna shift your weight when he's trying to pull up to break your guard and sit out onto one hip. Get your hand up behind his head. You can almost use this like a grip. See, I could be like completely off like this. When I turn over to him, I grab a hold of his wrist, slide my hand up underneath him, and I, I try and throw this leg over his back and sit down on my opposite hip. And that same motion, get the elbow as close to like where his belly button will be if it was on his back, and drive up. And here, you know, and then for the tap. And that's how you do a Kimura, Team Tech MMA, all day, every day. Team Tech MMA.